Denver 7 On Demand is brought to you by Ferguson and BAC Appliance Center. The best in bath, kitchen, and lighting for your home. I'm Tom Mustin with the latest from Denver 7. Another major development in the Broncos' ownership battle. The NFL announced they will start arbitration in the court case involving who can take control of the team. Bill Bolin, owner of Broncos owner Pat Bolin, wants to abolish the trust that is now running the team. In a lawsuit, Bill Bolin says the trust is not carrying out the wishes of Pat, who's now living with Alzheimer's. That's why he's asking the court to allow the NFL to arbitrate. With DIA's increased use, the city is ready to revamp the Pikes Peak parking lot airport area. In just the last few hours, Denver City Council approved a $19 million upgrade. That money will go towards repaving and building new islands for travelers waiting for the shuttle. The project should be completed by sometime in October. Well, another day, another delay for the controversial red flag bill. Tuesday, lawmakers were set to take a final vote on the measure designed to get guns out of the hands of dangerous people. That vote is now set for Wednesday. And tonight, the Senate President, Leroy Garcia, says he will not support it. And from the First Alert Weather Center, here's a check on your forecast. Windy and warm tomorrow with a high of 75 degrees. A couple chilly days, uh, 47 and 43 for the weekend with chances of rain and snow. But we rebound nicely with a chance of showers on uh, Tuesday with a high of 60 degrees. Still pretty spring-like. This has been your Denver 7 On Demand update. Thanks for joining us. Check back here later for another update and download the Denver 7 app for breaking news and alerts. I'm Tom Mustin. Have a great day.